Hey friends, and welcome to the channel. On this episode of Blank This, we're celebrating summer. And what's the best way to celebrate summer than ice cream? We're doing ice cream sandwiches. These are Nightingale ice cream sandwiches. This is the classic, and this is strawberry shortcake. Yeah, I'm excited, and I know you are too. Let's go. As I get my Vanna White on, we'll start with the classic, because it's the classic. And I mean, if you can't get the classic right, you can't do anything else right. Nightingale ice cream sandwiches, chocolate brownie cookie, vanilla bean ice cream. And since it's ice cream, I won't do the fun facts. It's also kind of tiny, so I'm not even sure if I can even see it. But what you got there? Oh, there you go. Boom. Classic. Oh, wow. Can you see that? It's thick. Yo, that's a monster. That's like, what, two inches thick? No comment. But, okay, I'm not gonna even smell this. I don't think you can smell ice cream, but you know, I try. Oh my gosh. Here we go. I think it's a chocolate chip in the brownie. It has to be chocolate chips in the brownie, but it doesn't even mention it on the um, packaging. And yo, this is delicious. I love the chocolate chip at the end. Oh my goodness. It's a lot of ice cream. This is an epic ice cream sandwich. The size, the taste, picture it. Homemade ice cream sandwich. Would you imagine that to be? This is it. Like if your grandmother, the one that could cook, made homemade ice cream sandwiches, this would be it. The brownie cookie is delicious. The ice cream is amazing. I'll admit, it was like $5. So I was like a little bit put off by that. But with the size and the taste, it's worth it. If you want to be like me, I'm like ration it out so you get two servings. But this is the business. Mm. That chocolate chip kiss me every time. I'm here for this. The ice cream is so rich and creamy. The brownie cookie does not get lost at all. Okay, Nightingale, y'all better come through. Whew. Now after that delicious moment with the classic, the bar has been raised. So let's get into strawberry shortcake. This says brown sugar cookie, strawberry ice cream. Oh, okay, that's interesting because I was expecting this to be more of like a graham cracker type situation. But brown sugar cookie. We'll see. Here we go. Oh, this has a smell. It smells like strawberry and, yeah, brown sugar. Again, nice size. Look at that. Boom. Fat. Smells delicious. Oh, rich, just like real strawberries. For $5, I'm hoping it is real strawberries, but this is a really good flavor ice cream. Here we go. Mm. 
Okay, so the brown sugar cookie has a slightly softer and thicker texture than the classic, but it's really good. It's sweet, but not overly sweet. This is heavenly. But I really think this would work even better as just like regular ice cream with bits of the brown sugar cookie mixed in. But it's good though. You won't go wrong. Whew, I think I hurt myself. Nightingale, y'all came through. Those are like the best ice cream sandwiches I have ever ever had. Period. Full stop. They are good. Oh my goodness. Wow. Good thing I don't already have a summer ready body because it will be gone this summer because of Nightingale ice cream sandwiches. Again, we tried the classic, which was definitely my favorite of the two because you really can't go wrong with that. But rich, tasty, so flavorful. And we also tried the strawberry shortcake, which also blew my mind because, again, it had the brown sugar cookie. And I was totally expecting something graham cracker-ish. Uh, strawberry ice cream was delicious, flavorful, flavorful with bits of um, strawberries. Oh, I'm still having a moment. Oh, my goodness. But get you some. I found them at the local Key Foods grocery store, but I think they're also available via Gold Belly, because y'all know Gold Belly is just doing everything these days. So if you can find some, get you some. Whew, child. Delicious. So far, we're winning with the ice cream again. Today's Nightingale ice cream sandwiches, and then we also did the uh, Life Raft Treats Not Fried Chicken Ice Cream Bar. That should be up in the sky right there with the little eye. Amazing. So yeah, I'm still having that moment. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. But thank you for tuning in to this episode of Blank This. Oh, and a very special shout out and thank you to Lily for recommending the Nightingale Ice Cream Sandwiches. Whew. You came through. And thankfully, I don't have to blacklist you because that was amazing. I really can't stop phrasing those ice cream sandwiches. <laughs> but if you tried any of Nightingale's ice cream sandwiches, let me know what you think. Either one of the two or both of the two we tried today. Or if you tried any of their other flavors, I would love to know what you think and which is your favorite. Drop it in the comments below and I will meet you there. <laughs> Until next time, stay tasty and stay testing. See you on Blank Fist. Don't forget to subscribe.